Hi, I'm Doug Vernon NC, with NC State University Plants for Human Health Institute. I want to show you um, maybe a few tips about how to harvest your sweet potatoes out of a raised bed garden. There's two things you want to consider first with when you harvest. One is, have they been in the ground long enough? And that amount of time should be somewhere between 100 and 120 days. These sweet potatoes have been in for over 110 days now. The second thing is you'll see leaves yellowing and that, that even confirms to you that, okay, it's, it's a good time to go ahead and try, um, harvest those potatoes. There's some things that we can do before we uh, dig them that might be helpful. And one would be to give this plant a haircut a few days before. We're gonna just do this one here in the corner and we're going to cut off almost all of the foliage, all the vine there. There's a couple of reasons that we might cut these vines. One is if your soil is moist, by uh, removing all that foliage, we're gonna allow the ground to dry out as well as potatoes down below. And the other is the skins on sweet potatoes are very uh, tender. And by removing this, they'll toughen up for those few days that, you, um, that they're in the ground with no vines above and it'll help them be actually tougher for when you go to dig. There's a few tools you might want to consider using for digging your potatoes. One is a spade. This is a rather small one. Another is a spading fork. It's a great tool. Loosens the potatoes without digging all the soil up. But in a school garden, I kind of like these plastic hand shovels. I think they're, uh, they're one very safe and no one's going to get hurt using these. So we're going to use that today. Not bad idea to have a pair of gloves on for your safety and to some degree the safety of the potato, not scarring them maybe with fingernails. And then we wanna have a bucket to put our produce in. Uh, and when we fill that up, obviously it'll be moved to a designated area. So let's go ahead and take a look and see what's under here. I'm anxious to see. All right, here we go. Let's dig down carefully. Oh man, I saw some orange already. It's exciting. Okay, and once I get to a certain point, I can just go ahead and pull it out. There we go. All right, and this is the scarring that obviously we're trying to avoid. Okay, not too bad. We'll put that in our bucket. Let's see how many others are under here. This is one plant we're working on right here. Oh, we've got four more, terrific. All right, not too bad there. Might have hit it a little bit with shovel, possibly. Okay, so it looks like we've gotten five sweet potatoes to put in our bucket off of one vine. And there should have been 32 vines in this eight by four bed. So you do the math and figure out how many might be inside this bed. I hope this helps. Uh, enjoy your harvesting this fall and remember that you want to dig these before it frosts. That is the, uh, that is the time that it, they have to be dug by. So 100, um, 100 to 120 days, but before frost occurs. Today we're gonna be taking out potatoes, sweet potatoes. Do I find nothing? Oh, I found something. Hold on, hold on. Oh, hold on. What are you doing down there? We got big fishes. He got a good spot though. He got a good spot though. I'm not the cat in there. What are you doing? Oh, look! I love it! Can I be like that? Evan, how's it going? Good, I'm almost, I'm almost getting it out. You guys have it out? There's one right here. Because there's just three. I found two. I got three. Way to go. I found another one. It's really stuck in here. <laughs>